are currently on our way to go get a piercing. YouTube world, it's your girl here, back at it again with another video. So I figured I might as well make a vlog out of it because I've been wanting to get pierced for like such a long time and right now I currently have six piercings and I'm ready to add another one so I've been like putting it off for a long time and I'm so so excited and I'm on my way to go get another piercing but yeah so we're on our way to Berkeley and we're about to go get pierced and by we I mean me a little longer than a few minutes later but yeah I'm kind of like scared but at the same time it's like everyone gets it done nowadays so I'm like if literally everyone can do it then maybe I'll be okay but I'm still a little nervous and I don't know like I was really nervous before I got my rib pierced and then I ended up like not hurting at all but then I know that pain is subjective but yeah I'm a little, I'm a little nervous Maybe a little bit, a little nervous. Probably gonna have to nervous pee. Thumbs up this video if you too nervous pee. <laughs> and say dumb things when you're a little nervous because that makes two of us. So we're currently walking to Zebra and I'm getting increasingly nervous. But when we first got to Zebra, the man at the counter was so nice. He calmed me down a great deal while I picked out my jewelry and got all of the cleaning supplies for afterwards. Here, since we had a lot of extra time to wait, I took a picture that I had on my phone and started drawing dots on my face to see where I might want my piercing to go. So the guy who actually did my piercing was the absolute best. He was joking with me to try to calm me down. Um, he started by cleaning my nose and then he placed a few dots on my nose so I can see if that's where I wanted the piercing to go. I had plenty of opportunities to look in the mirror to make sure that everything was fine and dandy. And then he went ahead and pierced me using the needle. Truthfully, this was the most painful part of the entire experience, having the needle on my nose and waiting for him to put in the jewelry. I would say that this was more painful than the actual couple of seconds that I was getting pierced. Um, he told me to keep my eyes closed, which I want to say helped a lot, but also I was like anticipating the feeling. Later that same evening. These are a few of the products that I picked up from Zebra for aftercare. I use the antibacterial most frequently. It says that you should use it morning and night, but because my piercing has been bleeding a little bit, I use it in between when I need to clean the blood off of my face. And then also I use the emu oil in the morning, the distilled water and sea salt I use at nighttime and I've been soaking my nose for about 5 to 10 minutes each night. Overall, I am very, very happy with my decision to go ahead and get my nose pierced. It's something that I was putting off for about three or four years now, and I am so happy that I went through with it. I would say if you have your parents' permission, or if you're of legal age and this is something that you were thinking about doing, go ahead and go for it. It feels great to get over your fears. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, turn on push notifications, all that good stuff, and I hope to see you next time. Yo, nigga with a nose ring, that's right. I'm just here to rap.